Thank you. <laughs> we got letters from uh, that Senator Hammer brought from a county judge. That staff is making a copy of it this time. So, uh, as you know, we can't bring the letters here since the uh, author of the letter is not here to ask questions. Senator Pitts also has a letter that uh, I guess you'll distribute to uh, staff and have them to make copies and get out to the members. Is that fair enough? Do you have anything you want to add? Well, only that I misspoke and said it's from the local chamber. It's from, and I've had about 15 emails, it's from the Fort Smith Regional Council, and it's a representation of 20-plus CEOs and their desires. They want a better district. It's not from the chamber. It's from the Fort Smith Regional Council. So whatever the chair's preference is, they've asked me to read it, but we could, if you choose, to hand everybody that song. How lengthy is the letter? It's... Two small paragraphs. It's on my phone, half a page. Okay, I'm going to live this time. Okay, I could even abbreviate if you'd like. No, you go right ahead. Uh, dear state agencies, the Fort Smith Regional Council, a group of area CEOs and business leaders, has voted and formally endorsed having Fort Smith and the surrounding area remain within the third congressional district. As you review and debate the current redistricting proposals, we wish to relay that any scenario that results in Fort Smith and Sebastian County being divided and or moved to the 4th Congressional District is not our desired outcome. The Fort Smith region has made too much progress. There are too many examples to list the ways our engaged congressional delegation has assisted our efforts, not the least of which is the foreign military sales mission, the statewide focal point for workforce training in the Peak Innovation Center, to name a few. From our perspective, the evidence is overwhelmingly simple. Our resources, geographic location, talented workforce, infrastructure, and quality of place are exactly what companies and families are looking for, and our position in the 3rd Congressional District is the foundation for that success. Mark Michael Barr, Chairperson, Fort Smith Regional Council. Okay, thank you, Senator. If you need copies, you, should, you also have a copy of the letter from the county judge. You will get that to distribute that to the members. Members, those letters will be coming from two county judges, from Senator Hammer and Senator Pitts. And other than that, no further questions from committee members. No one else has signed up to speak. Uh, hold on a minute. I have signed up.